Good morning, vlog fam. Welcome back to a new vlog. Today I am getting ready to work out. And I actually just got some new workout gear from Nike. So I thought we could start this vlog off with a little mini haul, show you guys what I picked up, what I'm gonna be wearing to the gym today. Thank you so much to Nike for sponsoring this portion of the vlog. They have a lot of really cute options that are also very good quality. But one of their coolest new products are these Nike One Leak Protection Biker Shorts. They're like period safe biker shorts, which is so cool. And I love the way that they fit. So like they have this super thin absorbent liner in the bike shorts. And like it's made to move with you. It feels very comfortable. Like I can feel when I'm squatting, when I'm moving, it's not getting like bulky or bunchy or moving around. It really does like stay in place and move with you. And they are not sheer, they pass the squat test. We're not seeing anything through these. And the back of these have a contoured V shape to give you a nice silhouette. And one thing I like about Nike products is they have the dry fit technology. So like you don't stay sopping in your sweat. You have a quicker evaporation. So it's just a lot more comfortable. I hate workout clothes that like hold the sweat and you just feel it on you. <laughs> and something I love, these have two hidden pockets. We've got one right here. We've got a bigger one in the back that can hold your phone. And they made these to look like they're regular bike shorts. So like you can't tell the difference between these that have the period protection and their regular bike shorts. Like they look the same. No one will be able to tell. Working out like should not have any stress when you have your period. And these are amazing. They feel so like secure. They feel so good on the body. I know I'm not the only one like when I'm working out and I get off a machine and I like, if I'm on my period, I look down like, oh God, please, please don't tell me I left anything behind. You don't have to worry with these. And then on top, I am wearing the Allate Trace Bra. This is such a nice bra. This might be one of my favorite, favorite plus size workout bras. I just called it a workout bra, it's a sports bra. I don't know, I couldn't think of the word. But first of all, this color is dynamite. It is so pretty. I've also never said dynamite in my life. I love this like pinky color, so pretty. And it's got like medium light support, but like honestly, this is like the max that I need. This just feels like enough support to like keep me in place while I'm doing the elliptical. I feel very supported, but I don't feel like too supported. And the back is so cute. The cute little Nike symbol on the back is so pretty. A nice thick supportive band, which matters. And I'm not actually on my period right now, so I am going to change into a different product, but I wanted to show you guys how amazing these bottoms are. So then I grabbed a pair of the Zenvi leggings. These are the 7 8 legging. So for the Nike one that leaked protection biker shorts. I got these in a 1X and I got these leggings in an XL. Let's go ahead and try these on. Ooh, hoo hoo. These feel like a second skin. Okay, you guys, these feel amazing. These are so like stretchy and buttery. They have a nice light support. I can't explain like the fabric of these. What are these made of? Infinisoft. <laughs> So soft, you won't want to take them off. Gentle hug, opaque coverage, buttery, soft, comfort and support. Yes, they describe that perfectly on the tag. <laughs> These are like some of the best leggings I've ever felt. <gasps> wow. I've never tried their Zenvi leggings. I'm so glad I finally did. This is definitely the gym fit for today. I feel like you can move so well in these and like these would be great for the gym, but also just for like lounging at home. I will link all this down below, obviously, in the description box. And I'm so excited because I wanted to try some shoes from them. So I got the Metcons. These are the Metcon 5 women's training shoe. I love this like kind of dusty rose color. And I've actually already worn these once and they are so comfortable. And I actually have like a slightly wide foot, not a full wide width anymore, but like they accommodate my foot really comfortably because they've got these, um, this kind of shoe tie here. It gives you more room to loosen if you've got a slightly wider foot like me. Like you put these on and they just feel like, I don't know, they just really support your foot without feeling tight or uncomfortable. So these shoes are gonna be great for training, going to the gym and doing some lifting. And I feel like this outfit is so cute. You guys, oh my God, these leggings are so comfortable. And there's something about these shoes that just give you like the perfect amount of support, even kind of up around the ankle. Like it just 
I feel very supported in them. And they're super stylish. So I'm off to the gym, I'm all geared up. Uh, make sure you check out these Nike products, linked down below, they are all so good. And I would especially recommend trying these leak protection bike shorts. No more worrying when you go to work out. Honestly, even just wearing these for life in general, like with an oversized t-shirt and biker shorts, that's like my summer uniform. And you'll live worry-free. So thank you Nike so much for sponsoring this portion of the vlog. I'm not sure if I've got anything exciting going on today, but we'll see what uh, later has in store. Many hours later. Yara's putting on Bruno's harness cause we're going on some family errands today. It's a beautiful day. Well, it's gonna get hot. So we're just gonna take the dog with us. There's like this shop area that lets you bring pets around the whole outdoor mall and in all the stores. So we're just gonna peruse. We also need to go to UPS. I have a couple Amazon returns and a package that I need to send out. And we have a Target pickup with just a few little groceries and toilet paper. I wore my hair in a bunch of braids last night. I did like four braids just to like Give a little texture, a little crimp, so I wouldn't have to use heat. Here is my warm weather outfit for running errands, and I'm obsessed. Guys, I have been breaking in the Burks. I will say it took a couple days, but I wore them like crazy, and they already feel totally perfect. The dog is so excited, so let's, let's get going. Are you so excited? Do you wanna go for a ride? You wanna go for a ride? Once that harness is on, he knows. <laughs> you love the car. You love the car. I even got a pair of slide Birkenstocks. These are officially my new obsession. Did you freak out when I went into the store? But your dad's in the car. Your dad is right in the car. We got eye boogie. Can I clean it? Nope. All right. UPS is checked off. Now we're heading to our little outdoor mall to walk around with Bruno and just enjoy the nice weather before it gets too hot. Hi, baby. First stop, dad is getting a smoothie. Is it? Yeah, let's go outside. <laughs> Thank you. Everyone loves you, Bruni. You're so handsome. All right, what'd you get? Triple berry oat. Triple berry oat. Right. Delish? Yes. Not us stopping for a picture moment here. home i just made myself a little tuna wrap i'm gonna have some with some quest chips yar is having leftover lasagna for the millionth day god bless i'm over it <laughs> and uh we're just gonna chill out for a little bit and then i'm gonna get ready later to get dinner with our friends at hibachi i'm so excited so i will check back in with you guys in a few hours when i am getting ready for dinner many hours later i am giving christmas right now <laughs> with the red and the green i'm not gonna wear this headband with the outfit. I don't know where this bruise came from. Um, but I'm gonna wear this Abercrombie dress tonight because it's still really hot. I don't know if I'm gonna change my hair a little bit, but I love this dress. I've been waiting to wear this, waiting for the warm weather. But I just threw this headband in to get the hair out of my face. Don't know where, it, <laughs> look at these two random spots for blemishes. So like I said, we're going to Hibachi tonight. I was contemplating even putting on like skin makeup because it is warm, but I don't know. I just felt like it, you know? You either feel it or you don't. We haven't been to Hibachi in a minute, um, but we just chilled for a little bit and then I watched some Never Have I Ever because the new season came out. And then I was thinking <laughs> while I was watching it, I was like, am I too old for the show oh i think there was oh shoot oh, i had brown powder 
girl i had brown powder on that brush anyway i was like am i too old to watch these shows now like i because so, i don't feel 30 at times and i'm like watching a show about high schoolers <laughs> anyone else like that but never have i ever is such a good show and i was so excited when the new season came out i've been like plowing through it and i have one episode left and i'm like i'm gonna save this <laughs> let me know if you guys are the same way where like when you have one episode left you just like <laughs> cherish it and save it all right charlotte tilbury beautiful skin shade number four i'm gonna do some kosas concealer rare beauty bronzing stick i wear this literally like every day it's so good you know the drill we gotta blend the nose contour with our mini beauty blender this thing is the best let me know what other shows you guys are watching i think next i'm gonna watch the new season of the ultimatum we're almost done with the newest season of dave we'll see what's next i'll check back in with you guys in a sec when the makeup is done a few moments later okay you guys so i had my hair like wavy so i ended up just throwing it up and doing some little romantic curl i'm having a hard time with this one though you look crazy maybe i broke it up too much oh it's also very long i did not mean for that one to be that long <laughs> oh not really feeling myself tonight but it happens so all right i'm just gonna buck up <laughs> and we're gonna go have some good dinner with some good friends. So let me show you guys the dress. She's summery. She definitely has pockets. It's from Abercrombie. I'll link it below, but I love the leaves, 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 and the cute neckline, cute poofy straps. Okay, I'm trying to figure out what I don't like about the outfit or the hair or the makeup. So I'm gonna switch to these bigger earrings. These are from Walmart. They're so cute. Yeah, I think I need a bigger earring. I think that's what's happening. Or I might just be in one of those moods where nothing really feels right. But I have like 10 minutes, so I'm going to try to figure it out <laughs> until we leave. I haven't worn these earrings yet, like I said. Super cute from Walmart. They're kind of like a triangle hoop. Is it me? Or is it something I can fix? We'll just put on more body spray. I feel like it's my hair. I feel like I don't like my hair. That's my automatic toilet. It'd just be talking. Should I involve my husband? He probably won't be of much help. A few moments later. Babe, can you come here? I need, I need guidance. It, it's like, it's the hair or the dress. Maybe I don't like them together. Don't you just like hate these days? Okay. <laughs> I can't figure out, it's, I'm not wearing these shoes. I can't figure out the situation. Is it the hair, the dress, or the combination? I don't feel right. <laughs> He's looking me up and down. What's the situation? Is something off? Is it the Do poof? You have clear shoes? I'm not going to wear these shoes. Oh, then you're fine. These are my comfy house shoes. Yeah, you're good. Everything else is good? Yeah. Really? Yeah. You sure? Yeah. The poofy hair and the poofy sleeves are not too much. Yeah, you're good. Great. <laughs> Thank you. Nice day out. Yeah, no, that's perfect. Okay. I trust you. Yeah. All right. Well, I'm glad you do. <laughs> Are you, do you know what you're wearing? Is that what you're wearing? Yeah. Okay. You're very casual and I'm very dressed up. That's got to be, uh, that's got to be most couples. <laughs> Are you depressed that we're going out? <laughs> The look he's giving the camera. He's like, damn it, I know you guys are going out without me and I'm pissed. Don't give me that face. Oh my God, you can make me cry. Yeah, I'm not wearing these. I'm not wearing these sandals with the dress. These are my UFOs. These are my lounge and house sandals because they're so squishy. next day and before i head to the gym i wanted to try something 
different for breakfast because I feel like everyone's coming out with like homemade or pre-made egg bites like the ones at Starbucks. I love Starbucks egg bites. So um, when we were at Whole Foods, I grabbed these. So it's uncured bacon and cheddar cheese. I don't think I've tried these unless I'm having a full brain fart, but I, I've tried other ones. No, I don't think I've tried the 365 ones. So let's try them and see if they're anywhere near as good as Starbucks. They're half the price, so. Okay, so it has you take off the top layer, microwave safe plate, cover with a paper towel. We're gonna microwave for two to two and a half minutes. All right, the egg bites have been cooling because I'm not trying to like take a bite and be like, <laughs> they're too hot. So here they are in all their glory. A little close up. They look pretty good, we'll see. I've got a lot of thoughts. These taste like the Dunkin' Egg Bites. They don't taste like the Starbucks ones. Probably because it's like a different cheese. The texture is more dense. They're not really like fluffy like the Starbucks ones. I don't know if it's like the type of bacon or the type of cheese, but it's a lot like saltier and more dense. And like kind of the flavor is like more smoky. What is uncured bacon? What does that mean? Bacon that hasn't been cured with nitrates. Okay. So it's healthier, I assume. I I think if I wasn't going into this having tried and loved my Starbucks egg bites, these would probably be pretty decent. They're so much more similar to the Dunkin' ones than the Starbucks ones. I don't love the flavor. I don't love the smoky saltiness. Um, I like how the Starbucks ones, I guess they're like the sous- Sous vide, I don't know how to say it. They're like more of that whipped, light, airy texture. These are more dense. I don't love these, if I'm being honest here. I don't love it. I'd give it like a, like a six. But that's just on my personal preference. It's not like they're bad. And I'm gonna eat them because I need to eat something before I go work out. But like, I'm definitely not gonna buy them again. Yeah, which is very salty and smoky. Not totally the vibe I'm wanting. But if you like the Dunkin' ones and the taste of those, it's a bit more like that, and I would recommend for you. I'm so sad. I don't think we have a Costco anywhere near me because I've been seeing people find the Starbucks ones at Costco, and they have like a huge box. Is there a Costco anywhere near me? Yeah, the closest one is almost 40 miles, so I don't think I'm gonna do that. Imagine I like get a Costco membership and drive 40 miles to get a pack of Starbucks at-home egg bites. Honestly, I would 100% do that. <laughs> but I'm too busy right now. We've got a busy, busy week ahead. It's currently Monday, and we are starting to shoot our project on Friday. So I am going to be running around like mad, mad this week. <laughs> so tonight, I'm going to a Red Sox game as well with my mom. We're going to get food before, and then go to the game. And I gotta work out. I have a lot to do in between. It's a crazy week, y'all. It's a crazy week, <laughs> so. All right, I'm going to head to the gym. I'm not really feeling it, I'm tired. <laughs> so we're gonna push through and we're gonna have a good day. Many hours later. Okay, you guys, I worked out, showered, did my hair and makeup, just filmed an Amazon haul for the month, edited the Amazon haul, and now I'm gonna put away my pickles using my new pickle jar that I got from Amazon. I'm very excited about it. Look at this. I just washed it and I'm very excited I love pickles. So the cool thing is you'll never have to reach into a pickle jar again with all of the juice. So, oh, <laughs> the pickles are stuck. Okay, come on pickles. My pickles are awkwardly large. This is such a cool concept to me though. Like I just think this is genius. <laughs> Okay, so when you want your pickles, that's how you turn it. And then you put it back this way when you want to just keep it in the fridge and it will keep your pickles in the juice. So, like, this is so cool, you guys, come on. And then when you want to eat your pickles, it drains the juice to the bottom so you can easily access your pickle without having to reach into pickle juice. And bada bing, bada boom. Why is this like the, this is the future to me. Screw the Vision Pro from Apple. This is my future. Anyway, 
I'm pretty stoked about it. <laughs> Many hours later. All right, mom and I just got to Boston. And Hello. We're talking about inflation. Inflation. Because there's a guy right here doing 55 bucks for parking. It says Fenway events, $55. We're not even super close. It's all the way down there. It's at least a half a mile to a mile from here. And the last year we came, we parked closer. closer. Oh, there's, is that where we parked last time, mom? The 55 parking? Oh, maybe. That has to be where we parked last time because it's 0.1 miles. I think so it should... was $40 last year. Now it's 55. Oh, yep. there's Bar Louie. Yeah, let's just go here. This is totally where we parked last time. Yeah, I remember time. the little alleyway. 55. Oh, you're so nice. <laughs> Are you going to be nice? Thank, Thank you. you. Yeehaw. Oh, my God. That old man was so nice to see. That stop. old man was adorable. I want to date him. Oh, hey, good. How are you? Can I use my debit card? We could send you back up the alley to the eight. Do you have $5? Yeah, I have $5. Okay. 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 Okay, wait. Here, hold on. I'm giving them an easy exit out. Thank you, because we, we won't stay you. the whole game. No, we get to restless. We get, all right. Awesome. Okay, thank you. Don't hit me, buddy. All right. All right. <laughs> thank you so much. You Have a great night. Thank Thanks. You. you bringing your water? Yeah. Uh, no. You sure? We'll get a drink there at the place, no? Okay. I don't want to carry this bag <laughs> around. background <laughs> so cute all right y'all hopping on here to end this vlog i am editing it right now i hope you guys enjoyed and you know the drill i'll see you in a few days okay i love you bye